Coming up, my review of Project Power. Welcome to Instant Movie Reviews. Once again, I'm J. Scott Sibley. Project Power is a film full of fascinating ideas and concepts, and like a lot of original superhero films, it never quite lives up to its potential. Jamie Foxx and Joseph Gordon-Levitt deliver fun performances as they navigate this chaotic film. Foxx plays Art, a man whose daughter's been taken by a shady corporation, and Gordon-Levitt plays the cop assigned to take him down. And this all takes place in a world where a pill gives you superpowers for five minutes. And maybe powers isn't the right word because some of the abilities are downright horrifying and the film does venture into almost body horror gross out moments at times. I'll put it this way, I don't think I'd take a pill. You shouldn't take the pills. No one should take the pills. But the film's real power, and did you like that segue, is newcomer Dominique Fishback, who plays Robin, the film's main character and heart. She holds her own against Fox and Gordon Levitt and delivers a star-making performance. And personally, I can't wait to see more of her in the future. The script does take some detours and forgets to pay off some of the things it's set up. The movie does start strong, but by the third act, it's entered generic superhero territory. And the two directors of the film over-direct it, getting lost in their own visual style that sometimes makes it confusing and messy. But Project Power is a mostly fun watch and a great late summer movie. You know those kind of movies that come out in August, in a normal year, in the movie theaters? This kind of fills that void. I give Project Power three and a half out of five. And hey, don't forget to like this video and leave a comment if there's movies you want to see reviewed on Instant Movie Reviews. Until next time.